the gorgeous deep indigo of him gleaming, solid tight flanks, the intricately ridged abdomen. And after he'd invited me to his room, nudging his key towards me as if perhaps I spoke another tongue and required the plainest of gestures, after we'd been, you understand, worshiping a while in his church, he said to me, Hi, my name is Steve Sada. I'm the artistic director of Iron Crow Theatre, and I am collaborating with BT Dance and Vincent Thomas on Homo Will Not Inherit. And my name is Tony Bird. I am a graduate of Towson University's dance department, also an actor and photographer, and I have been working with BT Dance now since about 2004, 2005, as a guest dancer and also as a guest stage manager. Awesome. How was the process for this piece, Homo Will Not Inherit? Collaborative process. Um, the three of us came together. Uh, Vincent really took the strings when it came to the choreography. Uh, Steve had a lot to say with the text. Um, and then I just kind of filled in whatever blanks I could. Um, but the whole process was just really explored, a lot of exploring. Um, just a lot of improvisation at first to figure out where we want to start with the base and how we want to develop it from there. Yeah, the piece really started with the text. Um, I have known this poem for a very long time. I'm a big fan of the author, Mark Doty. And I've always wanted to put his work on stage, but I didn't really feel like a strict dramatic presentation, like a play, was really what it wanted because the text has so much movement in it that I began to think about sort of a dance theater fusion approach. Um, so I was putting together a couple of years ago um, a, a sort of a cabaret evening of art, art presentations uh, in celebration of Gay Pride, and I approached Vincent and asked him if he wanted to work on this poem with me, and we actually didn't do it that year, we did it the next year. Um, so it started with the text, so Vincent sort of came in with with movement around the images, and then my role was kind of to find the movement in the text, because that's kind of my specialty. And so we kind of met in the middle and found where the, the things overlapped and when they were discrete and how we would want to put the two things together. Wow. 